Now what we have here is probably one of the oldest and maybe one of the coolest uh, books that I have. And it is a book by Alec Guinness. Yes, most people know him from Star Wars, but he's been in a whole bunch of stuff. You'll know him. You'll love him. The book is called Blessings in Disguise. And this is uh, 1983, apparently, this one. And if you look, it is signed by Alec Guinness himself. Now, looking at the signature, uh, below it, you'll see what looks like it says 1986 I'm guessing I mean the, the the one looks a bit like a T but um but it is pretty cool to know that in my possession I do have Ben Kenobi's autograph actually I have both Ben Kenobi's autographs I do have a Ewan McGregor signature somewhere in my signed photo things so I'm uh, I am now officially a collector of Ben Kenobi signatures uh, this is something that I picked up, to be honest I can't even remember where I picked it up, but I picked it up many, many years ago. Uh, and this, you, you'll see me on some other videos mentioning photographs in books and oh, there's no middle section with pictures. This is what I'm referring to when books do this and have little sections. Smells like an old book, which is amazing. It's a really good way to build up an autograph collection uh, having signed books and also they don't tend to get damaged as much because the signature is is protected under this hard cover um, I've suffered with some damage to some of my signed pictures because uh, I stupidly had them in glass and you know they got damaged and stuff so they're they're well protected and out the way now but a signed book unless you obviously pour coffee over it or something and uh, this is a, also a book I haven't read. I'm so terrible at not reading books. But how impressive is that? The signature of the wonderful Alec Guinness, who sadly passed away in the year 2000, I believe. Time flies.